Hallelujah. God bless you. I'm the Lord increase in the mighty name of Jesus. God bless you. I'm the Lord increase in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. This particular prophecy, what I want to bring, I'm going to be, uh, this word is going to come out very fast, but I want to also emphasize something before I get into the word. I just want to say that if you're new to my channel, you're welcome. And also, if you are somebody who deliberately wants to grow with your spiritual life, I have a particular uh, network of people I'm teaching right now on Zoom on a daily basis, and that has to do with people who desire to be foot soldiers. Who are foot soldiers? Foot soldiers are people who believe that they were called to live a particular life, to, 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 to be used as an end time amen for the Lord. And, and they believe that beyond just going to church, there is something inside of them that keep crying for expression that is wanting to serve God in a more better way. And if you fall in that category of people whom you see yourself, probably your dream, uh, praying for people, or maybe you grow up with a very strong desire for God, wanting to serve God, but you have never been ordained, you don't know whether you're a pastor, but you just know that you have this strong body or this desire of those who are chosen by God. I would like you to to drop a comment on the comment section because I'm going to be dropping a link on the comment section of this video on the description of this video so that you can get to also access this particular Zoom, um, uh, this particular Telegram um, uh, space so that I can teach you on Zoom and help you become better. Amen. So this particular word is about somebody, somebody who is in love in, in with you. There is somebody who is sincerely in love with you in this season. Yes, this person is sincerely in love with you in this season, but this person has been praying that you should be actually somebody who really wants to walk in God's calling for your life. Yes, this person has also been praying to God that they, their spouse should be somebody who has accepted their calling with God so that they will not get to be rejected when they begin to focus to do God's will because your partner right now actually wants to serve God in the way that God created this person to serve God. And so one of the things this person has been praying for is that you may be able to receive the particular push in your spirit that helps you to serve God deliberately and not come to God because you want to receive things, but that you want to actually deliberately grow in the things of God and serve God because you love God, not because so many things are meant to be happening. The reason why I'm bringing this word is so that you can receive this word and, and grow in the light of the prophetic blessings that is upon your life. God bless you and may the Lord increase you in Jesus' name.